Hey what's up guys my name is Omer and in this video I'm going to talk about some of the best devices you can purchase for under 30,000 rupees. So if you haven't subscribed the channel yet consider yourself subscribed and also hit the bell icon so whenever the video goes live you will get the notification. Now let's get started. Here are some of the devices I have notified the main points of the device. Coming to the number one is Honor 6X. It comes with Huawei company. It comes with 5.5 inches display with 403 ppi pixel density, a 12 megapixel rear camera, 8 megapixel front facing camera with 3 gigabytes of RAM, 32 gigabytes of internal storage, running Android Marshmallow out of the box, but already it comes uh, no good with a no good update, so that's good. It also powers 3340 mAh battery. Supporting fingerprint sensor 2. Device looks really great. The latest device from Huawei Honor. It, you can grab it for 26,490 rupees. Available in two different colors, white and black. The link of the both colors have been given in the description, so you can check that too. And overall, the device is really cool. The design is really good. There are dual camera sensor that makes twice much better with the camera too, and the performance is also really good. Now coming to the next one is from Lenovo. It is Lenovo K5 Note. It comes with 5.5 inch display with 32 GB of internal storage, 3 GB of RAM. It also comes with 13 megapixel rear camera with 2.2 aperture and 8 megapixel front facing camera. It comes with octagon processor with 4 into 1.8 GHz and 4 into 1.0 GHz. It's also really good device, definitely supporting uh, 4G and figure with sensor. Design is also really good. You can grab it for 27,845 rupees. Link is given in the description. Again, this device is really good, good design, not that really bad. And under this price range, it's really good with a good specs too. And camera is also really good with 2.2 aperture. Next on the list is from Samsung. So I don't recommend much of the Samsung under 30,000 but this one is a good deal. This one is Samsung J7 Prime. You can grab it for around um, 27,400 rupees. It comes with 5.5 inch display, 3 gigabytes of RAM, 16 gigabytes of internal storage, optical 1.6 gigahertz processor and the Fredis camera is also good. It is from Samsung. So you can check out all the specs and details on the other one. The design is also really good. Definitely it is a must purchase if you are a big Samsung fan or something like that. It's also a great device. You can grab it for link is given in the description. The another device is in Phoenix 04. Is this plus one? I do not recommend this device. Let's talk about first the specs. Specs are really great. Processor is Deca Core processor of 4 GB of RAM, 64 GB of data storage, camera is really good. But still I don't recommend why because Infinix is doing very bad with their devices as their XOS is really really buggy. Now not only that, if you check infinixmobility.com you will came to know that the devices from the last year have been discontinued and they are not even shown on the website. So that is going to happen again. When the 05 comes or Note 4 comes, you will not going to get anything about 04 and Note 3. They will again discontinue these devices and even they delete from their website. That is not really good. Like they totally stop supporting their old devices. That is a very very big negative point for a company like this which is right now in a way of emerging in the country. But I'm really really sad about this you can say. But still this is an option if you can if you want to buy it you can consider it but from my side in case of long terms it is not recommended but if you are a person who use a device for a very short term like for four and six months then you can purchase this one but if you're going to use it for a six uh, for a one year or more then do not purchase this device these were all the devices you can buy under 30,000 rupees i hope you like this video if, if you did give this video a big thumbs up but if you didn't put the positive feedback in the comment section below if you have any questions, you can ask on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter and Snapchat at UBTB1. All the links have been given in the description. And one more thing, today I am going live on Facebook around 12 o'clock, tonight mid 12 o'clock. So if you have any questions, you can go there and you can answer it. So wait for that. And yes, links in the description, check out all them. Thanks for this video, like and share this video, subscribe to the channel. See you next time.